everyone, this is David with Esol's E-Bikes and I'm here to introduce today the most fabulous bike I've ever created and that's the new Dual King Star. As I've grown over the years, we're in our sixth year now, we specialize in high performance, high speed, high torque bikes. I was the first to offer an all wheel drive, dual motor, dual battery bike. I brought it to the table, and today I'm bringing to the table something brand new, and it's so revolutionary, no one can, can have this technology. This is a, a frame that 700,000 tests were done on and then certified by an independent lab. Your safety is my concern. 1500 watt Hentec motor propelled. 147 newton meters of torque. It's got 60 volt batteries, 20 in the front, 15 in the rear. It's got a 56 tooth chain ring, so you're ghost pedaling, not gonna happen. And I developed a dropout. This is the dropout, this piece here, this big thick piece. If we take the nut off here and off the other side, we can ride this bike with, with confidence that we're not gonna lose a wheel. I've got a, a piece here that slides into the dropout that we now lock that dropout down. So even with this removed, the axle's not gonna move. But also the design here is once this nut goes in, you can see it's fully surrounded by the dropout, adding additional um, support. This is my no drop dropout and nobody's got it. So it's an E-Cells exclusive. We've also added, instead of the turny shifting system by Shimano, we've upgraded it to the, the Astro system. We've added a, a rack here. It's certified to 110 pounds. 110 pounds. I've added this extension here. It's tied into the rack. Now we've got six points of contact to, to transfer the weight and, and bear the load. I've gone to a, a fatter seat. Um, it's a lot more comfortable and it's a, a, it's quite attractive. Well, another unique feature that we have that I developed almost six years ago was the, the integrated charge port. This allows you to charge both batteries at the same time using one single port. No one else has it, that's my deal. Another feature that's included on this bike. We've got the rear rack and the cord here. I now have it plug into the frame of the bike. Right here, this little plug. You can order this um, as an added accessory for those that are buying the normal King Stars. Plugs right in and uh, you can easy removal. No messing with the wires and, and screwing all that up. Here we have E-Cell's cool plate technology. We've got two plates here on both sides. It wraps itself around the controller. This brings the heat out to, of the controller onto this outer dissipation plate. And so we're not having any problems at all with thermal shutdown. A really big change is you notice that the pivot point is raised above the crank on the, the bottom basket and by and by lifting that up and setting it up here we've created such a smooth uh, ride with the suspension the wheels on my bike another feature if you look here we have eyelets this little guy slides into the the double walled wheel and then the, the, the nipple goes on top of that. As we start to move in the direction of being a higher weight capacity, one of the important things was is, is the strength of the wheels and by adding the eyelets we are able to, to strengthen that area. What we've done here is for the, the dual crown series is we extended the fork on the bike. This is actually a KKE. It's a, they make motorcycle forks. This particular fork is an inverted fork. 
This is actually the sanction of the fork. The body drops in to the sanction. We added metal plates here that we attached to the base of our fork. And now what we've got is, is the ability to adhere the front fender very solidly. It's a um, it's just there's four points of contact and it's it's stiff. We've got 203 rotors front and rear Tektro 2.33 thick. Yeah, it's the BMX handlebar. But if you look down in here, you can see the grooves in the handlebar. This is powder coated. It's made made by Pro Max, and I uh, demanded a stronger stem for the handlebars. And 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 this is uh, Pro Max came up with this this here. If I drive down the road and I'm doing 30 miles an hour, suddenly a truck pulls out in front of me and I don't see him. And and next thing you know, I'm going to have a frontal impact. This area concerns me a lot. And I've been working with, with companies to try to develop a 50 mile an hour impact rated um, here because you're, all your weight is going to go on the handlebars at the stem is going to want to snap. And so if your handlebars fall forward, you fall with it. The next thing you know, you got, got the stem stuffed up in your, in your chest. Um, so this, this here is, is the best I can get right now. Um, the sense of strength of handlebars and, and the stem. So what we've got is turn signals that they can automatically come on as caution lights. And it's a great feature because when I shut the bike off, if I had the caution lights on, the program's gonna remember that. And when you turn the bike on, you got the caution lights automatically. This bike also incorporates um, my APT 750 display. We've not only given you miles an hour, quite visible, we also give you um, your wattage on the bike. Um, so what's very important, of course, for a lot of guys is how much range can I get out of the bike? Well, by watching watts, you can easily keep your, your, your throttle down. This incorporates both batteries. I, right now, right now you see, you only see one. Well, wait a minute, I forgot to plug in the rear battery. <sighs> Suddenly then, two batteries show. And you can either have that in voltage or percentage. We also have a feature in here that, that allows you to set your, level, your, your, your class levels. Class one, automatic kicks the throttle off. Class two, you got both. Class three, automatically goes 28 miles an hour, kicks the throttle off. And then it also has the unlimited mode, of course. We've incorporated the Buffong torque sensor and through working with the firmware with the, with the controller company and APT we now have the ability to switch from speed based or torque based on your drive. One of the reasons the uh, we changed to the Landian an APT is number one. Well, I've been using these for five years. Been using Landium for five years, and uh, um, they were able to bring to the table what we call field weakening technology. That doesn't affect the torque on the low end of the bike, but when you start getting into the higher speeds, we weaken the field to where the motor can actually run faster. It has less torque, but when you're doing 40 miles an hour. Uh, you don't really essentially need torque, you just want RPM. This particular bike we've tested repeatedly and uh, it's, it's, it's going to take you over 40 miles an hour all day long. I hope you, you can appreciate what we're doing. These bikes um, are, are currently um, $27.95. No taxes, we don't charge any taxes, we don't charge any shipping. We don't add, add added fees.
to the sale. And so I welcome you to check us out, resales.com, and this is the, the Dual Kingstar.